Well, what I can tell you is that um, at approximately 8.30 last night, uh, officers were dispatched um, to the area of Bluff Street in reference to um, anywhere between three to five um, gunshots that were, were heard. Um, these gunshots were also heard by uh, two Scotts Bluff County deputy sheriffs that were in the area. Uh, so um, our department, along with assistance from the sheriff's office and the state patrol, responded to that area and, and began the investigation. It was determined uh, throughout the night that um, that the shots did come from the Bluff Street area. I would say between Avenue I, south of Railway, north of East Overland, south of 20th, in that in that part of town. There was a second report of gunshots fired. Again, officers spoke to the witnesses and the the uh, reporting parties that called those in. Um, at this time. I'm not sure if it's a separate incident or if it was part of the initial one that the officers had responded to. Um, were any casings found throughout the area that was being um, searched? Not at this time. Um, uh, a canvas search was conducted by the various agencies uh, in the area and uh, nothing was found. Uh, we would ask that the public, if they have video cameras or, or um, anything like that, which might have caught something in that area, to please let us know. Uh, take a look at that video, and, and if you have something, uh, let us know. And again, they can contact uh, the comm center to provide information, or Crime Stoppers at 632-STOP. Okay, and um, I presume that there was no damage reported to homes, vehicles, or persons? No, nobody was injured. Uh, we have no reports of uh, damage to any buildings or vehicles. Um, again, that's where we ask the citizens to help us. Take a, take a look at your house if you live in that area. If you do find something, um, simply just give us a call and we will send out officers to uh, collect that evidence.